Hi everybody, it's Beth, and today I'm making over a couple of the Dollar Tree glass cutting boards. I grabbed two of the Dollar Tree glass cutting boards. They come in two different shapes. Some of the Dollar Tree fall fabrics, some of their gel super glue, a razor blade, and dishwasher safe Mod Podge. I started by removing the little feet on each of the cutting boards. Just used the razor blade and popped each of them off. And then you'll need some rubbing alcohol as well. I just put some on a paper towel and rubbed off all the little residue left behind from removing the little feet. And then just wipe down each of the cutting boards. Next, I just opened up the fabric, placed the cutting board right on top of it and traced it out. And then I cut out just a, a little bit bigger than where I had traced and then trimmed up. And I tried to trim up without cutting right on the line, just a little bit bigger. And then placed the dishwasher safe Mod Podge on the cutting board. Now the ones I grabbed, they're smooth on both sides. Some of them that you get are a little rougher on one side, but these ones are completely smooth on both sides. So it doesn't really matter which side you do on these ones. So I just did a generous amount of Mod Podge and then placed the nicer side of the pattern face down. So the nicer side on the Mod Podge and smoothed it out. So the nice side will be showing through on the top of the cutting board. And then I did not wait for that layer to dry. I just did another top layer of Mod Podge right on top of the fabric. Just another generous layer. And then I repeated that same process with my round cutting board and my other fabric. And then I used my heating tool to dry that layer of Mod Podge. And for these cutting boards with the dishwasher safe Mod Podge, it does say to apply one to two coats. So once I dried that first outer layer, I did another generous layer of Mod Podge on top of that one. And for the dishwasher safe Mod Podge, it does say that you can put them on the top rack of a dishwasher, but they just need to be cured for 28 days before you can do that. So you just have to let them set for those 28 days before putting them in the dishwasher. And after they're completely dry, those two outer layers of Mod Podge, I placed the cutting board down and took my razor blade and just went along that edge where the fabric met the cutting board and just cut along there and the fabric just cuts off nice and easy. So I just trimmed it up on both of those. So these are super cute. I'm not gonna use them really as cutting boards I like to use them for little trivets or 
I really leave them next to like my coffee pot or my stove to put little spoons and things on. They're really cute, great gift ideas. I just love them so much. And the last thing I had to do was reattach the little feet. So I just used some tweezers to hold them so I didn't get super glue all over my fingers. And held the little feet and added some gel super glue to the little feet. And then just placed them back on the bottom of the cutting board. So the not so nice side of the fabric where you had placed all that Mod Podge. And that is it. So easy, but they look so pretty. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video.